I think one another thing that's made me kind of go into looking at it is that I obviously know about falling in love as like a young guy falling in love for the first time as a teenager and or whatever and having various relationships growing up and, and reaching this point now but this like previous like well two years ago I became a dad and this year I got married and I think both of those things massively massively make you like assess and look at love in a different way particularly becoming a dad I think is like that's just such a an amazing joyful like exhausting but magical experience um but like you just it's I remember my mum always used to say to me like you'll never know until you have a kid what it's like and she she was right um and 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 it's like a, you, you think you know what like love is and then you find out what love actually can be and and I think it's sort of in our, in my relationship with my partner as well I think making that kind of step towards marriage was like a real commitment and there's something about that that's like wow okay this is like another level again um and you, I think naturally when you get married, you you look through your entire like history that leads you to that point, and and maybe the part of part of these songs came from that. But in terms of like things, I'd love to talk about. I I listened to a record recently that I think is really amazing by a band called Flight, who are based in the UK. I don't know if you've heard of them. And I haven't. I'm gonna look them up. Yeah, so it's spelled F L Y T E, um, and they're they're awesome. Um, and their new album is sort of sort of like I feel maybe I'm I don't want to sort of put words in their mouths or anything like that. But it feels like it's an album that's really about uh being in a kind of quite happy relationship or like it's not there's no big drama. It's just quite like it's just sort of beautiful and honest and but it's like little things. It's it's not oh that's my dog Nelson going crazy. But it's um it's just like little things in, in a relationship. Nelly, come here. Hey. <laughs> Like like your dog barking loads. It's the kind of things that they talk about in this in their songs. But it's just it's a really beautiful album, and it's not there's no high drama or anything. And I think I'd love to learn how to make an album that's less uh, reliant on tension and sadness, and was actually just more exploring like I don't know somehow writing interesting songs about a quite peaceful life would be the dream. But I think you need to have quite a peaceful life to write those songs and. Uh, I don't know if I have that, but we'll see. Well, but the, to bring kind of the interview for a full circle then, because we we earlier on in the interview we talked about kind of that the reason the way you write songs is that you can't can't help but be very very vulnerable and introspective and those kind of things. Yeah. Um, and then that tends to go towards the more melancholic, I suppose, or the more uh, sadder side of life. So, how do you imagine your songwriting if, if you are happy or if you are in a in a very happy go lucky mindset yeah it's um it's become a lot harder um i think yeah i think i think it's i think it is difficult to write songs when you are sort of my overriding thoughts now are sort of like waking up uh taking my daughter to nursery you know make, making sure she has breakfast and sort of and cleaning up after it and all that stuff so very like um little jobs and 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 kind of yeah, like, and, and I feel very, oh, sorry, hey, Nelson. Um, sorry, he's just very yappy today. Oh, like, no, no, that's all good. Yeah, um, but yeah, just like, I, I, yeah, I think that's one of the things I'm, I'm sort of learning is like, I, I do feel relatively happy at the moment in terms of like, I feel very lucky. And that's challenging for, as a songwriter. It's quite a difficult environment to write songs in. But um, I'm just, I just keep trying, keep trying things. And I'm naturally a reflective person as well, so I think I'll always, to some extent, find things. But yeah, it's um, it's a good question, and and it remains to be seen. I think. <laughs>